All right. Hand me some of the duck sauce. Okay. Why is it? Is he listening? I'm listening. You sure you're listening? Charlie, I'm listening. Is this the last packet of duck sauce? Yeah. That's it. These people have won the damn war, Sam. Sure, maybe we dropped the bomb on them, walked away with a win. Now they own half the goddamn country. I'm not talking real estate. Cars. They make better cars. Oh, bullshit. They make better cars, Charlie. Give me some of that rice. I'm not going out and buying a Chrysler just to have it break down after two months. Fucking treason, Sam. It's a shitty habit, Charlie. It's good for the gums. And the cost factor. They make better cars that cost less. You see what Detroit is putting out for that kind of money? Garbage. Your wife and kids are going to wake up someday and find a Jap standing in your house. Tell you you got to get out. Oh, you know, you're nuts. You'll see. They're taking over the car industry. Buy from the Japs. You're selling your soul to the devil, Sam. <laughs> There he is. Senior, you cops must think I'm a jerk. Hey, we gotta ask. Why'd you kill your roommate, Brian? I didn't kill anybody. Hey, listen, it's about 12.50. He told me 1 a.m. Now, I finish your drink. You know Winch, scared little shit that he is. Sees us both, he'll freak. Be sure. Yeah, I'll get whatever information he's got. Hey, relax. Lick your wounds or something. When it's time for you to get out, I'm sure that a nice job with a good pension will be arranged for you. No more risking your neck. But not before it's time. You're a marked man, Alex. Like they say, you know too much. The department won't let you leave for your sake. As well as ours, you know that. <laughs>